subscribe to our YouTube channel for the latest updates. Tropical Storm Mikala is approaching the eastern coast of China where it will make landfall very shortly as a high-end tropical storm with winds of 65 miles per hour, perhaps 70. It's currently at 23.4 north, 117.8 degrees east. There's its current intensity right now and its satellite appearance there on the uh, inset moving north-northwest at 13 miles per hour. And this is the latest as of 6 a.m. in China and we're looking at the CDPS scale for Xiamen City uh, for later today. We expect a stage 2 landfall as the storm moves through. Um, wind speed and rainfall being the bigger threats there. Uh, rainfall expectations could reach about 150 millimeters, but we do expect that the rainfall will be short-lived as this system is rather small. Look at that, a uh, very small wind field, uh, only up to 60 miles in the southeastern quadrant, and that's the largest of them all, uh, and down to about 25 in the northwest. It's currently 70 miles from Shantou, 76 from Xiamen, 115 from Guangzhou, 207 from Fuzhou, and 364 from Wenzhou. A yellow typhoon warning is in effect for coastal regions of China from Dongshan northwards to Pingtan. So currently at 65 miles per hour, JMA slightly higher, up near 70 miles per hour on their latest advisory. Um, advanced Dvorak technique values in the lower 60s, so you've got a pretty good consensus there at 60 something mile per hour winds probably. Uh, most models expect that it will peak now, it's going to make landfall very shortly anyway, but CTCX holding out a little bit of hope that it might reach typhoon status before it reaches land. I doubt that somehow. Wind shear is going to rise anyway. Sea surface temperatures were just about to fall as well. Uh, landfall will really uh, stop the storm in its tracks before it gets much stronger. Uh, but with a small storm like this, you can't rule out that maybe it could do a little bit of rapid intensification. Uh, but given how close it is to land right now, we're literally talking, what, two hours, maybe less, before it moves ashore, uh, the chances are really slim. But you can see there blowing up a lot of convection and wrapping around almost all sides. You can see it sheared off towards the northwest, so really struggling with that. Um, but starting to get a better hold of itself in the later frames there as we look at the water vapor imagery. Uh, but the bulk of the storm is still yet to reach the Chinese coast and there's probably quite a bit more rainfall on the way if you haven't seen it already. Check out our new look cyclone tracker on the Force 13 website for the latest up-to-date information. You can also find us, of course, on our YouTube channel, search Force 13, and also on Facebook and Twitter, Force 13 at Force 13 on Twitter for the latest updates. You can also help the project become even better by becoming an Ultimate Fan on YouTube. To see the full list of Ultimate Fan benefits and to join, visit youtube.com forward slash force13 slash join. With a special thanks to our top supporters this month. You can also check out our growing merch store so you can show Force13's colours wherever you go. You can also find a link to our Discord server underneath this video in the description.